PDFs, those ubiquitous digital documents, are often seen as benign tools of information sharing. We use them for work, school, and everyday tasks, trusting them to carry important data. However, for hackers, PDFs represent an enticing attack vector. Their seemingly harmless nature makes them perfect for concealing malicious code. Hackers exploit vulnerabilities in PDF readers and the Android operating system itself to gain unauthorized access to devices. The beauty of a PDF exploit lies in its ability to remain hidden in plain sight. To the untrained eye, a malicious PDF looks just like any other. This makes it easier for hackers to trick users into opening them. Once opened, the malicious code embedded within the PDF springs into action, exploiting vulnerabilities to compromise the device. Think of it like a Trojan horse. From the outside, it appears harmless, even desirable. But hidden within its depths lies a dangerous surprise. Similarly, a malicious PDF carries within it the potential to wreak havoc on an unsuspecting user's device. The allure of PDF exploits for hackers lies in their potential for stealth, their ease of distribution, and their ability to target a large number of users across different platforms. In a world increasingly reliant on digital documents, understanding the risks associated with PDFs is paramount to staying safe online. PDF readers, like any software, are not immune to vulnerabilities. These vulnerabilities are essentially flaws in the code that hackers can exploit to bypass security measures. These flaws can exist in the PDF reader itself or in the underlying Android operating system. Imagine a wall protecting a valuable treasure. Vulnerabilities are like cracks in the wall, weak points that hackers can exploit to gain access to the treasure, your personal data. Hackers are constantly searching for new vulnerabilities. They use sophisticated tools and techniques to probe systems for weaknesses. Once a vulnerability is found, it's only a matter of time before it's exploited. This is why it's crucial to keep your software, including your PDF reader and Android operating system, up to date. Updates often include security patches that fix known vulnerabilities, making it harder for hackers to exploit them. Think of these updates as reinforcements for the wall, patching up the cracks and strengthening the defenses. Metasploit is a powerful open source framework used by both ethical hackers and malicious actors. Think of it as a sophisticated toolbox filled with various instruments, each designed for a specific hacking task. One of its key features is the ability to create and exploit vulnerabilities, including those found in PDF readers. Ethical hackers use Metasploit to test the security of systems and identify weaknesses before malicious actors can exploit them. It's like a controlled demolition where potential weaknesses are exposed and addressed in a safe environment. However, in the wrong hands, Metasploit can be used for malicious purposes such as creating and distributing malware, including malicious PDFs. This is why it's crucial to understand the power of such tools and the importance of ethical hacking practices. The existence of tools like Metasploit highlights the ongoing arms race between security researchers and those who seek to exploit vulnerabilities. As new defenses are built, new attack methods are developed, making constant vigilance and adaptation essential in the cybersecurity landscape. Creating a malicious PDF with Metasploit is a relatively straightforward process, especially for someone with even basic technical knowledge. Hackers can choose from a library of pre-built exploits or create their own, tailoring them to target specific vulnerabilities. Once the exploit is selected, it's embedded into a seemingly innocuous PDF file. This could be a document, a form, or even something as simple as an image. The goal is to make the PDF appear as enticing as possible to increase the chances of the victim opening it. Think of it like baiting a hook. The more appealing the bait, the more likely the fish will bite. Similarly, Hackers try to disguise their malicious PDFs as something the victim would find interesting or important. Once the malicious PDF is created, it's ready to be distributed. Hackers use various methods to get their creations into the hands of unsuspecting victims, often relying on social engineering tactics to trick them into opening the file. Section 5. The Art of Deception, Social Engineering Tactics Social engineering is the art of manipulating people into revealing confidential information or performing actions that compromise security. It's all about exploiting human psychology rather than technical vulnerabilities. 
Hackers use various social engineering tactics to deliver their malicious PDFs. They might send phishing emails that appear to be from legitimate organizations, tricking victims into opening attachments or clicking on malicious links. They might also use social media to spread their creations, disguising them as interesting articles, funny videos, or too-good-to-be-true offers. Imagine receiving an email that looks like it's from your bank asking you to update your account information by clicking on a link. You click the link, expecting to be taken to your bank's website, but instead, you've just downloaded a malicious PDF. The key to successful social engineering is to create a sense of urgency, curiosity, or fear that overrides the victim's natural caution. Hackers prey on our emotions, exploiting our trust and our desire for quick solutions or exciting opportunities. Section 6. The Trigger when the victim opens the PDF, the moment a victim opens the malicious PDF, the exploit swings into action. It targets the vulnerability in the PDF reader or the Android operating system, attempting to bypass security measures and gain unauthorized access to the device. This can happen without the victim's knowledge, as the exploit often runs silently in the background. Think of it like a silent alarm being triggered. You don't see it happening, but it sets in motion a chain of events that can have significant consequences. The exploit might install malware on the device, giving the hacker a backdoor to steal sensitive data, spy on the victim's activity, or even take control of the device remotely. The possibilities are as varied as they are dangerous. This is why it's crucial to be cautious about opening PDFs from unknown or untrusted sources. Even if a PDF looks harmless, it could be harboring malicious code that can compromise your device and your privacy. Section 7. Breaching the Fortress – Gaining Control of the Android Device Once the exploit has successfully compromised the device, the hacker can gain various levels of control, depending on the nature of the vulnerability and the sophistication of the attack. They might be able to steal sensitive data stored on the device, such as passwords, financial information, or personal photos and videos. Imagine a thief gaining access to your home. They can now rummage through your belongings, taking whatever they deem valuable. Similarly, a hacker who has gained access to your device can steal your digital valuables, which are often far more valuable than physical possessions. The hacker might also be able to spy on the victim's activity monitoring their keystrokes, tracking their location, or even accessing their camera and microphone without their knowledge. This can have serious implications for the victim's privacy and safety. In some cases, the hacker can gain complete control of the device, essentially turning it into a zombie under their command. They can then use the compromised device to launch further attacks, send spam emails, or even mine cryptocurrencies, all without the victim's knowledge or consent. Section 8. Covering Your Tracks – The Importance of Anonymity Hackers, especially those engaged in malicious activities, go to great lengths to cover their tracks and remain anonymous. They use various techniques to hide their true identity and location, making it difficult for law enforcement to track them down. Think of it like a criminal wearing gloves and a mask to avoid leaving fingerprints or being identified. Similarly, Hackers use digital tools and techniques to mask their online identity and activity. They might use virtual private networks or VPNs to route their traffic through multiple servers around the world, making it difficult to pinpoint their physical location. They might also use proxy servers, which act as intermediaries between their device and the Internet, further obscuring their identity. Some hackers even go as far as using the Tor network, which is designed for anonymous communication, making it extremely difficult to trace their online activity. The lengths to which hackers go to remain anonymous underscores the importance of cybersecurity measures and the need to stay vigilant against such threats. Section 9. The Fine Line Ethical and Legal Considerations Hacking in itself is not illegal. In fact, there's a growing community of ethical hackers who play a vital role in improving cybersecurity. These white hat hackers use their skills to identify vulnerabilities and help organizations strengthen their defenses. Think of them as ethical burglars who break into systems with permission to expose weaknesses and recommend solutions. They operate within the bounds of the law and with the consent of the system owners. However, there's a fine line between ethical hacking and illegal hacking. 
When hackers exploit vulnerabilities without permission or engage in activities that cause harm or steal data, they cross that line and can face serious legal consequences. The legal ramifications of hacking vary depending on the severity of the offense and the jurisdiction in which it occurs. However, the potential penalties can include hefty fines, imprisonment, or both. It's essential for aspiring hackers to understand the legal and ethical implications of their actions and to ensure they operate within the boundaries of the law. Section 10 Staying Safe Protecting Yourself from PDF Exploits Protecting yourself from PDF exploits starts with awareness. Be wary of PDFs from unknown or untrusted sources, especially those received via email or social media. If you're unsure about the legitimacy of a PDF, it's best to err on the side of caution and avoid opening it. Keep your software up to date, including your PDF reader and Android operating system. Updates often include security patches that fix known vulnerabilities, making it harder for hackers to exploit them. Consider using a reputable antivirus software on your Android device. Antivirus software can help detect and block malicious files, including PDFs, before they can harm your device. Be cautious about the information you share online, especially on social media. Hackers often use social engineering tactics to gather information about their targets, which they can then use to create more convincing phishing attacks. Finally, educate yourself about cybersecurity best practices and stay informed about the latest threats. Knowledge is power, and in the ever-evolving landscape of cybersecurity, staying ahead of the curve is crucial to protecting yourself and your data. Section 11, The Ethical Hacker, A Guardian of the Digital Realm In a world increasingly reliant on technology, ethical hackers play a crucial role in safeguarding our digital lives. They are the guardians of the digital realm, using their skills to identify and fix vulnerabilities before malicious actors can exploit them. Think of them as digital superheroes, fighting tirelessly to protect our data and privacy from those who seek to exploit it. They are the unsung heroes of the cybersecurity world, working behind the scenes to ensure our online safety. By understanding the tactics and techniques used by hackers, Ethical hackers can develop effective countermeasures and educate users about potential threats. They are at the forefront of the ongoing battle against cybercrime, constantly adapting and evolving to stay one step ahead of malicious actors. As technology continues to advance, the role of ethical hackers will become even more critical. They will be the ones who help us navigate the complex landscape of cybersecurity, ensuring that our digital lives are as safe and secure as possible. It's a challenging but rewarding field, one that requires a unique blend of technical skills, creativity, and a strong ethical compass.